This is National Minority Health Month. New statistics show cervical cancer rates for African American women are nearly two times that of Caucasians. And here in Cook County, the rates are among the highest in the country. So joining us this afternoon to talk more about this and a new examination procedure is Dr. Dexter Harrington from the Southwest Women's Healthcare Associates in Olympia Fields. Thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you for having me. We appreciate me. you talk about the, the fact that African-American women two times more likely to, of course, be diagnosed with cervical cancer versus um, Caucasian women. Let's talk about the new procedure, that new examination out there. Right. Let's talk well, a little bit about the process. Cur currently, we use something called a Dysis Colposcope, and this uh, is a machine or an instrument that we use to look more closely at the cervix. Colposcopy is always done when the pap smear comes back abnormal, mm -hmm. and this procedure starts off very similarly. Uh, what you see is actually a touch screen that provides a high uh, uh, high definition and high resolution image of the cervix. There is a color coded overlay of what's being seen and it helps to identify more precisely the areas that we need to biopsy. So is that what makes it more accurate than yes. other procedures? Yes, because previously colposcopy was performed and the physician basically looked through the microscope and mm -hmm. said this is what appears abnormal to me. Now this is becoming more standardized because of a patented technology that allows the distribution of the solutions and the cell uptake to show this is where you need to biopsy. So what we're looking at right now on screen, doctor, it, it almost kind of looks like a colonoscopy, the way that that procedure is done. Is that similar? Well, it's not quite a colonoscopy. Oh, but, no, oh I know, but the, 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 the technology being the technology, used, though. The technology is very similar. There's no question technology is similar. And the thing also that's nice is you can see, if you look, uh, there's a nice monitor that the patient can actually see. So mm -hmm. as opposed to just being in a vulnerable, uncomfortable position for right. 15 or 20 minutes, you can now be interactive with your patient and explain this is what we see this is why we're biopsying this. So this is new, does that yes, mean it is a little bit more expensive? No, it is not uh, more expensive to the patient. It is greater technology and I think it will help us be more accurate with what we do. Dr. Dexter Arrington, thank you so much for joining us. For thank you South, for having me. South Suburbs, we really appreciate thank it. You. Thank, thank you. you.